guys, my name is Casey and I would like to tell you my experience with egg or the white spot disease, whatever you want to call it. But I used to have angelfish, tiger barbs, and blue rams. I'm telling you right now, a lot of them were lost. I tried several egg treatments. I tried the quick cure, fast relief for egg. Didn't saw no improvements. I tried it on my 40 gallon tank and honestly, they all die right the third day. I also try this other one. It's pretty much the same one, except different color. But they also die. I did some water changes and I did also add aquarium salt. It did help, but I lost all my platies. Now on this tank that you see right here, I used to have angelfish, tiger barbs, blue rams, and a betta. And I also have two albino small plecos that are usually hiding behind the filter. Here's the blue ram. As you can see, she still has some small white spots. She still has some heavy breathing that's caused by their white spot disease. But, I used to have more, and she has survived. Now I'm going to tell you how I made her survive. Where's the other ones? Okay, I tried some other ones, and none of them work. I did try this one, the Super E-Cure. It says that it combats secondary bacteria infection, so that's why I got that one, and also it kills the parasite. I did follow the instruction, except the temperature change. So what I did, I added aquarium salt and I added a tab. One of these tabs. And it's usually a green powder. And that's what I added. I didn't see that much improvement, but I did saw a little. So I decided to add aquarium salt. I don't have it right here right now, but it's somewhere else in the house. Then I also tried this one. Honestly, my honest opinion, I don't suggest it. So I didn't try that one. Now, I've been trying this one daily. I did saw an improvement, but I will tell you what really did the trick. I read that apparently when you feed them foods that have garlic in them, like fish pellets and so on, it helps them sweat it off. So what I decided to do... A crazy idea. Hey, let me just open a garlic, chop it in half, and throw it in. Now, we did that yesterday. That one that you saw, the blue ram, the blue German ram, it had a lot of it. And today, it appeared like it had barely anything. So, I really suggest that it really did the trick. I didn't have to do much. All I did was change 25% of the water daily. I added stress relief coat. It's water conditioner, basically. Also, I fed them, and every time I fed them, I made sure to filter out the water really good. I did took out the filter cartridge to help it out. Another thing that I added was their bubbler. They used to not have one. We added one, so we'll help them out with the breathing. And now you can see how it has turned out. We lost, lost a lot of fishes, but with what we tried with the garlic gloves, we did saw a big improvement. You can see a garlic glove up there. It's pretty much growing with how long it's been there. And there is some other chunks in some other places. And as you can see, our water temperature never changed. It stayed at 78 degrees. And our fish looks healthy or healthier and more active. Like as you can see, he's swimming. At first, he was always down in the floor. He barely swam. He was just with heavy breathing. And now you see him with more movement. So I'm hoping you guys, if you guys try the garlic glove in your water and aquarium salt and a little bit of egg treatment, it might do the trick for you guys too. Good luck with everything and have a nice day.